Coach, talk about tonight's game. Well, it wasn't easy. Actually, I thought we played well in the first half. We, we worked hard. We created a lot of chances, and they caught us on a shot. There was a great shot, and it went in. But uh, we didn't panic at halftime because I felt like if we just kept creating chances like we had been, we kept our composure, it would come. And I didn't realize it would come in the first minute of the second half, but obviously that, that helped us get things going. And it's something to be out shoot a team 32 to 4 or something like that. But then that one goal of theirs went in, and that's probably wasn't one you were expecting, but how were you able to just kind of put that behind you and have the players just forget about it? Well, I don't think we were able until halftime. And, uh, you know, we kind of settled things down a little bit. We talked and just said, look, let's just keep doing the same things we're doing. And if they score another goal like that, what can you do about it? Uh, the kid hit a great ball. and uh, But, but it, it, it came around as we thought it would, and we did keep our composure in the second half. It seemed like your, your defenders, Chris Williams and... You know, he, he was in there in a goal on a lot of shot opportunities. You know, is that something that you've asked Chris to do more of, or do you like him getting that deep into the box? We do like having Chris and Joe both get into the penalty box, on dead balls especially. And in a game like today, when in the run of play, there's no room for them to get in. But as we go further into the season and we play teams that come out a little bit deeper, there'll be room for them to get in during the run of play as well. We'll talk to Chris Williams. Uh, Chris, you had a couple of goals that we thought were good there at first, but you had the offsides call, so you were trying to try and finally got one and uh, just kind of is it disappointing when you had those that were offsides and then how did it feel to finally get the, the yeah it's funny because coach talked um, <laughs> in the dressing room prior to the game and said he went to go and watch a match uh, yesterday and uh, a guy scored three goals and all three were offsides so it's quite ironic that I've gone out there scored two and then one you know Luckily, luckily went in and uh, it's a testament to all the lads great Kai, so great Kai let's go 1-0 down against our rivals it's very very difficult to, you know, to come back but it's just a testament to all the lads we, we dug in stuck together like we said before the game and we've come away with a, with a win in the, in the three points and your partner in the back line Joe Tate uh, he had the uh, assist on the game winning goal there and, uh, did, you, did you see Chris running up there do you remember that play at all um, funny enough he told me to, uh, to hit the back post so it's all about hitting areas, I think, on set pieces. I try to get it right, and I know, obviously, if I put the ball in the right area, Chris will attack it, so, mm -hmm. yeah, it's good. Seems like you guys have a good chemistry back there. Is that, is that you believe that? Well, we, we, we played together in the summer, so, mm -hmm. yeah, I think we do. I think there's still a lot more to come from me and Chris and, and from the team as well, so I think, I think, I, I think you know, things are starting to click, and we're going to peak. I think we'll be all right. And Coach Wells, you got the 4-1 win, and uh, it was, you know, tough at the start, but then we got the goals going in the second half, and now where do you go from here? What's the next step? Well, I don't, I don't know, first of all, should I translate what Joe just said? Or? <laughs> you give us a little clarity. <laughs> oh, just teasing, obviously. Uh, well, we've got a big match on, on Saturday. Um, uh, William Carey beat us last year 3-2. to two. So uh, we're going to train tomorrow and, and train Friday and get on the road and, and try and get ready for that. Sounds good.